Good morning, everybody. This is Mac, man. Mac, praise how are y'all? Man, um, I'm about to get ready to go to my church, pick up these kids uh, Sunday morning. Um, but before I leave, uh, I have to give you this dream that the Lord just gave to me. Like I, I, I just got up not too long ago. This is the honest truth. So I'm getting myself ready to go and pick up my my uh my kids and take them to the church. Uh, but before I leave, I need to tell y'all this dream I had. Now I know who it's for. It's for it's for people in this lifestyle. It's been a long time since I had a dream about any kind of any kind of rapper or anybody like that, uh, anybody um, in hell and things like that. Well, I, well, it ain't been a long, long time, but it's been a it's been a minute when it's dealing with these Chicago rappers and stuff like that. But the Lord decided to show me again. Uh, um, so let me pray and I tell tell y'all what I just saw. So. Father, you speak through me, Lord God. You get the honor and glory in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. I know I know why. I believe I know why I had this dream. Uh, well, I know why. Y'all, let me tell y'all something. I'm going to keep it just as 100 as possible. I, you know, when I have these dreams, I don't... On visions and things like that. I had plenty of other dreams that I don't tell nobody, but I know when I have something like that, I'm supposed to tell it. So, a lot of people are, a lot of people are dying and going to hell, and that ain't been nothing. It ain't been no secret, you know. The Israel and Hamas war. A lot of those people, I know, we feeling sorry for, but you know, Israel and Hamas. They both are the same. They both are without Jesus. And even though they are God's people, uh, every time uh, a lot of them die, a lot of them go in there too. It's sad. The Jews are going to hell. The Hamas are going to hell, you, you know, because they do not accept Jesus as their Lord and Savior. They might be God's people, but they are it really, they the same. They are, you may want to call Jerusalem, you want to, you may want to call Israel a pagan nation. I mean, it's some Christians there, but how they treating Christians over there is crazy. That's what they did to Jesus. Same thing they did to the Lord. But, and I saw, and in an open vision, I saw, you know, like those people, you know, in hell too, you know. But anyway, I'm going to talk about this. I'm always seeing something about, the Von fella. This time I seen the other rapper, uh, FDG Duck, and this fella King Von. They were fighting. All right, so it was this pit, uh, like inside of a a store. It was full of trash, and. They, it was these, I'm, I'm sure they were demons. I'm sure they were demons. Um, they were throwing, they threw King Von. Well, it was the group of young men. That's what it was. It was FVG, Duck. It was the Von fella. They had other people all fighting each other. All fighting each other. Um, I saw him throw Vaughn. They lit the pit on fire. Somebody lit the pit on fire. They threw him in there. It was like they were playing with him. They threw him in there, and he tried to. He was climbing to get out of this pit. And I saw the fella FBG Duck run, jump in this pit. Was trying to push, uh, was trying to push Von back off in his fire, and uh, I felt sorry for the man. I ain't gonna even lie. I felt he felt he looked weak, helpless, 
it was sad, man. And the boy FBG duck, like, it was sad, you know. And I heard a voice say, I heard a voice say, Vaughn was trying to change, you know, was trying to, but, you know, but he didn't make it. Uh, and these things, this big demon was just throwing these people, lighting this fire, to playing with them. Like, he was playing, playing with them. And, and, uh, it was, and when Vaughn climbed out, like, he climbed out. I don't know what happened to FBG. Uh, but they were fighting against each other. Like, and, and and it was this one fella standing beside Vaughn. He said, man, in life, I used to look up to you. It was a little short, light-skinned fella. I don't know who he was. He said, man, I got four kids. And 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 they pushed them. They pushed Vaughn back off in the, in the, in the fire and whatnot. And, uh, man, and, but somehow, like, Vaughn grabbed on to him, and, and he, and I was, I was right beside, I was walking right beside, it was a strange thing, you gotta understand, the spiritual realm and, and hell, it, it don't make sense, it don't make no sense, and, but he had a hold to him, and Vaughn was like, you gonna die with me? The boy like, I'm going to die with you. And he couldn't separate himself from him. Uh, and wherever Vaughn was, and then his portal opened. And so it was like he was being tossed from place to place, like one torment and then on to another torment. And Vaughn was pulling him. And Vaughn said, you going to die with me. Vaughn had a grit, his teeth in his mouth like he had on earth. I saw he had his teeth in his mouth. His, hair, his dreads were snatched out or whatnot. Uh, and... I saw, and I saw LBG, LBG had the, uh, the dreads in his head, and they were, it was a bunch of boys in his room just fighting against each other, and they will keep lighting this pit up, like throw gas in or something like that, and, and you know, like a, a torment, and, uh, and, and I ain't gonna lie, man, like when I was looking at, I'm looking at them, it was like, I felt so sorry for the boy, like I ain't gonna lie, I felt sorry for the boy, I don't know if it was his, if it just his torment, you know, or or they were really fighting against each other because I saw I saw the FBG fella fighting against Vaughn, trying to push him back, push him in, and he'll get pushed in, or or this and this big yellow demon man, this thing, it was just uh f jumping from here to there. You couldn't run, you know, couldn't run. He tried to get you, man, like you couldn't run from it, and uh. And he'll just throw you in there, grab you by your leg, and he'll throw you in the fire. And boy, boy, he tried to get me, got all you. But you know, I think I was just spectating. And uh, but when he was pulling this boy, this portal open, and I don't know what was in that portal, but that boy started to howl. He, you can hear him go, ah, ah, like you can, like it was, it was, it was. I heard him going, ah, 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 ah and I was like, oh. You know, like, I was like, I was, I was, I don't know who the little yellow fella was. I don't know who he was. I don't know who he was, who got four kids. I don't know what I seen. I heard him say it. And, and he was talking like he was still alive, but he wasn't. You know, he was talking like he was still alive, but he wasn't alive. None of them were. None of them were. And, and, uh. And they were all in the tournament, but wherever Vaughn got pulled to, like the portal opened, something pulled him up, you know, like slowly, and this thing, a portal opened up, and the boy arm um, and his arm um, meshed together, and he couldn't lose themselves away from each other. And wherever he was getting dragged into the next place he was going, uh, it was, the boy was screaming, man. The boy was screaming. The boy was screaming. You can just hear him go, <laughs> like you can hear him just die. Like, he just, Vaughn, like, Vaughn, you gonna die with me. Wherever they were taking him, he was dragging him along with him. And, and I was scared as crap. And then I heard, and then this thing that kept jumping, this big yellow demon that you couldn't, that, 
that you couldn't get away from. Uh, he 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 was throwing at people. He said the world need to know that the ground reaper is real. He said the world need to know that the ground reaper is real. And he was just reaping so um, I even saw that fella with name King Yellow Fella. You know, I don't know what's gonna happen to that boy. Uh I know he's still alive, but I saw him, you know, as a matter of fact, he was dying there with him, even though he's still alive, you know, he was dying there with him, you know. You make you make your bed in hell how you live on earth, you know, even though you ain't dead yet. If you you know, the Bible said we seated in heavenly places and and it's the same when you ain't seated seated in heavenly places. You seated in low hellish places because you already marked because you're living a lawless life, you know, you you headed to hell. So man, so and then I I jumped, I was able to get out of that that place. And a lot of souls were going into that place. It looked like a store. I don't understand why it looked like a store. I don't understand why. And souls were, and people were going into it. And when I jumped out, they were coming into it. They was coming into it. And man, and inside there's a big pit inside of there that they, that they light on fire. And they throw people in there. And it'll, it'll blaze up. It'll blaze up. And... And, but it wouldn't, it wouldn't continue to play. It was like someone, it like a, a place where they played with you at. Like, that's how it is. Like, they played with you. And they'll throw you in there, throw you out. And it, and you can't, and Von Klein, when he climbed out, he was laying in the, he was laying in there, right? I saw him laying in there. And he threw him in there. He was laying in there, like, I was like, and then they about to light the thing. Someone about to light it. Somebody went over there and, like, put gas in there. And he was trying to climb out. He was looking so weak. I was like, I ain't gonna lie. That's how I was. I was like, man, I feel sorry for a boy. Like, I ain't gonna lie. I was like, mm-mm. That's how I was looking. I was like, mm. And then I saw WG Duck while he was climbing up out. It was mattresses, dirty mattresses and stuff all in there. Like, stuff that would catch fire. He ran and jumped in a pit and try, and try to push him back down. And he was trying to get out. He was trying to get out, and and then we got out someone that pushed him back in. It was just like sad, bro. It was so sad, bro. It was sad. I'm, I feel sad now. They fought on Earth, fought against each other on Earth. A lot of people do, and they doing the same thing in and in hell, man. And, and I'm, I'm telling y'all, it's so many young people going to hell, bro. It's ridiculous. Y'all think it's cool, man? I promise you this. I promise you this. If you die, I'm telling you right now, you die in your sins, trying to be a game member, trying to be whoever, just dying without Jesus, man, y'all don't even understand. Don't y'all know that there's a lake of fire prepared for everyone that dies and go to hell? Don't you know that it never stop burning? Don't you know you'll be burned? Have you ever been burned in real life, how your skin boil up and stuff? Do you not understand? That's how it is. People think hell a joke, but man, people dying and they wake up in that place and bruh, you can't breathe down there. You are you are realize that you can never leave down there. Uh, man, a lot of young people going to hell. There's so many young people going young. I ain't just want to say black people. Young, a lot of black people. A lot of and 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 D one right. I'm gonna say this. Let me say it to Dirt, to to Fifty Cent, to Lil Uzi, to 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 Lil Wayne, to I don't even listen to no me man. He always been garbage. But when even when I was out in the world, uh, these rappers, all these drill rappers, Chief Keef, uh. And, and, and what's that boy name? Butter, FBG Butter. God, God having mercy on you right now. You need to really turn your life around. He helped you live. Your sister may have died, and I've seen your sister as well. My brother, y'all still talking about this stuff. Y'all need to let this stuff go. 
See, God ain't gonna bless Jay Hood because Jay Hood be talking the truth. I don't know none of these people. I be seeing little clips. I be seeing little clips and I see your people in hell when God is showing, but I don't know these people. I just seen the fella Jay Hood talk about it. You know how, and, and people want to call him a snitch. That boy saving and getting his soul saved. And while y'all being foolish, y'all losing y'all. So, Jay Hood, if you do hear this, if you do see this, God bless you, and one day you will, if you continue to follow the Lord and, and, and continue to let him shape and mold you and cleanse you and you follow Jesus and you keep speaking it, the truth, and you preach the gospel, and he going to work with you because I know you you know got things in your life you he need to help you with, you will enter heaven. Unlike a lot of your other homies that you've been, uh, been in old block with or in Chicago with, they will not make it. None of them. All these people that they uh, immortalize them, none of them are in heaven. None of them. Not even. I went. I've I've seen. He keeps showing me the Von fella. I seen. I seen another torment of Von when he when he um uh, when he was. I saw him running, you know, and he couldn't get the memory out of head. Him killing, and I saw the Ki girl in a in a uh like. In his, it was crazy how I can see that's who he was thinking about, and he felt bad about killing her, but he was tormenting her, and I saw her, I saw what he was thinking pop up, like in hell, this stuff come to reality. I saw her, I saw her face, and and man, man, you a murderer, bro? You don't go to heaven. Y'all killing man? Oh, y'all going to hell? Oh. Uh, what's that boy named Fulio? Uh, 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 Rico Reckless. All y'all going to hell, bro. And y'all think it's a joke. Ooh. One of them, once them demons get a hope of you and you and you and you realize you sorry, it's too late. And you realize when God judge you and that fire, when you see that fire, that it, ain't, it don't burn like, it don't burn like fire on earth. It, it's, it's hot. It's, it's almost blue. It's, it's, you, you, you will, you will be burning. And and it don't just get take it lightly, bro. Like it's burn harder than gasoline on fire, bro. You don't understand because it's God, anger, and wrath, and that's what you going. And that's what a lot of your friends going. And that's what a lot of people around the earth are going. And and man, I hate it for you. As for me, I'm living my life for the Lord. Uh, I thank you, Jesus, for everything. You know, I I got my faults and stuff, but I be doggone if I go to hell. I don't care about this dog on crazy war they got going on, people dying. I don't care about y'all little crazy rap songs y'all got. Y'all fighting over a block or fighting over a female or fighting over clothes and shoes. Y'all dumb and people selling soul and and, and they going, they going. Bro, I promise you this. So, man, listen, I, I promise you, bro. None of you gangsters. Rappers, artists, actors, whoever, politicians, none of y'all are hard as hell, I promise y'all. None of y'all are as hard as hell, I promise you. Hell, when you enter hell, you're going to break down and cry, I promise you. You're going to cry to your mama and to your daddy, and they ain't going to help you, and them demons going, ooh, we, ooh, ooh, and, the, and, and not having no God, and 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 who and the Holy Spirit ain't there and and nobody cares for your soul and there's no none stop oh my god and how they tormenting and how FBG was tormented how he had to keep trying to fight against Vaughn and they kept pushing him into this fire and stuff and, and whoever that demon was that demon said that demon said the world need to know that the Grim Reaper real and he show it and he going around killing people. See, the, the Bible said the devil going to steal, kill, and destroy. But the devil, he ain't death. There is an actual spirit that's called death that comes from people's souls. And it's the honor of God truth that when it's your time, when you time to die, he going to either take you, the demon either take you down there or the angel of the Lord going to take you up there. And a lot of people are going down there because they're living reckless lawless and they put nudes on tiktok and women shaking their tails and dudes and we in the last days and i promise god gonna crack that sky open all y'all gonna y'all gonna be scared as crap and trap run and hide it's gonna be too late it's gonna be too late i ain't going with you i gotta go preach to these young men and women that i do every sunday and teach them about the lord because they in a hood just like old block be shooting and killing over all that but i go pick them up every sunday 
that's why I'm heading go and save them. Because I be dang on my watch that these kids go to hell like these people in, in these other neighborhoods and cities. Because no one has taught them. No one is teaching them. And Mama Duck, you need to grow your tail up. I'm just going to be honest with you. You ain't doing no better. Y'all need to grow up. Y'all, y'all need to grow up. You need music industry. Y'all need to only grow up. Y'all need Jesus. Y'all going to hell. Y'all going to hell. Well, this is Matt Craig, and I, I said what I said, and I seen what I seen. The Lord showed me what He want to show me, and have mercy on all y'all that's alive and on y'all way to hell. I pray to God y'all see this video, cause I promise you, ain't no fun when you get down there. All right, peace.